All right, guys, welcome back to Separate Ways and Ada Wong's story. So we got to this point uh, in the last one where we took the lantern. Uh, we had the, the puzzle doors close on us once more. And there came out to be uh, two uh, particular symbols that I could not identify. I just I could not find them. So, you know, we're going to try to to figure this out as we go. If I may die a few times, we'll see what happens. So let's get through it. It's the Crimson Lantern. So like I said, I got to this point, we got a seahorse, but I have no, oh, that's another seahorse. Oh, okay, another seahorse. Yeah, they switched directions. I had no idea, and then two snakes. Okay. And it was right in front of your face the whole time. Okay, you know, I love how when you do things, like, for the first time, uh, it, it's not, like, apparently evident. And then all it takes is, like, a second look. I, I kind of sat there before recording the video, and I was like, what do I do? I, I, I have no idea what I'm looking for. I was looking on the walls and everything, and, you know, it turns out that that's all we needed to... to uh, that's all we needed to discover. It's just that it was the seahorse three times, just uh, rotated in different directions. So, why don't we put this on here? Okay, now for the second ingredient. Our Plaga friends might be present in this one. Okay, that's nothing. Okay, we can't break any of these. Yeah, we better save our, uh, better save our flash grenades, because we're gonna need them. Okay, that was the vintage compass, everybody. I was uh, I was a little too afraid to not take my concentration off of these guys because you never know when they're gonna uh, just come out and come Looks alive. Like goes here. Okay, silver bottle. That's most likely what's gonna go there. Let's uh, see if there's anything else. Is there anything in this room, actually? Okay, there's a locked treasure coming up. Yeah. And then we have... We have some stuff above. But it might be, there might be a room above us, so let's grab this bottle and see what happens. A trap. Of course it is! I don't even know if he missed. He might have missed us. There. Got a couple of these.
Okay, okay. Nice. That's a spinel or a spinal. I usually call them spinals. So. Glad we got a couple of those because we needed them. But, you know, I'm glad that I didn't run away from the fight because, you know, sometimes we're, we're kind of in a situation where, you know, maybe it is best to run. I'm just going to go ahead and make another one. Because it saved my butt there for a little bit. Shotgun. Yeah, we need... We're going to need some shotgun stuff here soon. So... Don't think there was anything else for us in this room. I'm surprised not all of them came alive. Because that's what I was expecting. I was expecting all of them to, but luckily only, only a couple did. Are we supposed to take this from the other side? Okay, I got some rifle ammo. And some shotgun ammo, thank you. We're coming into some more ammo. That's always great. Okay, so this is the locked, uh, the locked, uh, the locked box for us. So treasure in there. We're likely going to face more of them in here. This may be our golden ticket. Let's see if anything happens. I think I know what's coming. Yeah, me too, Ada. Just don't touch anything. Don't touch anything sacred yet. <laughs> Okay, more shotgun, thank you. Okay. Yep, that's the next next spot there. So there's a treasure in, in this one, right? Yeah, so we'd want to go that way. And, you know, like I said, if it comes down to it and we're going to need to just escape, let's just do that. Let's not try to... Uh, do anything crazy if it's if it's out of uh, if, if it's out of the if if it's out of uh, if it's not necessary. Let's just say that. <laughs> okay. Thought so. Oh, okay. So we got no choice. There we go. Okay. More are coming alive, I think. What was that? Oh, those guys are on the outside. Yeah, I have health, but yeah, we got to be careful.
Okay, I'm, I'm gonna need it now. <laughs> I'm just using it. Oh wow, they're all coming alive. Oh my gosh. Do we have the option for another flash? Yeah, we're gonna need it. I I don't have anything else other than the green herb. The the people on the outside are killing me. Oh my gosh. I don't have anything else. Like I don't want to use the gold the gold egg. I really don't want to use it. Come on, man. That, that's just one of those things where you can't do anything about it. You can't do anything about it. Like, she's in animation. As soon as she's done, you have, like, several frames that you need to... You need to consider as far as when it comes to, um, um, like, her cooldown. And then she, there's, there's no way for you to dodge. There's no way for you to do anything. So I think if we can take care of the two outsiders... Uh, first, I think that that's what I need to do. So let's do that first. Let's take care of them first. And uh, then we'll deal with these guys in here. Because like I said, all of these guys in here are coming alive. Eventually. So I was faring well, but then, you know, just things happen the way they happen. Because, uh, you know, of uh, how, uh, how things were happening and whatnot. Now, like I said, I think what's going to happen is I'm going to have to kill everything in here because um, I think this room opens up, but but then the uh, the gates, yeah, the gates come up. So there's no way for us to get out of out of here. And I think until we take care of everyone in here. So I am going to try to take care of the two crossbow uh, wielders before we take care of the knights, because a lot of times I was getting hit outside of the knights was them and. Um, that's uh, that's where we'll need to uh, put some of the focus into. So let's uh, see what we have here. Just a sloppy effort. I could have done better than that. The flash grenades to me seems like they're only going to really um, be valuable. And their use is when the Plaga is totally exposed. When the Knights are just doing their thing, um, I, I don't think I'm going to be able to, to do much about that. Yeah, we need 12 for the, for the shotgun stuff. So, yeah, let's just try to take care of them first. Where, where are they now? They're not here. Okay, how come I wasn't hit there? Okay, now now they're here.
Okay, that one's still alive down there. Ah. Ah, I got no healing. We're going to take this. Oh my gosh, another one. Come on, man. Okay, there's an area back here I was unaware of. Can we make a flash grenade? Ah, oh my gosh. I'm just going to take it. I'm just going to take it. I don't have any other choice, I feel. I can't, I cannot concentrate in this space. I just, I cannot concentrate. There's nothing I can do until I actually kill everything in here. And there's nothing, I don't think there's anything else I can make. I can make handgun ammo. Which I might, I might as well just make it because I'm going to need every shot. Guys, I cannot concentrate in this space, man. There's, there's just nothing I can do. There's nothing I can do. This is frustrating. This is frustrating because there's just, there's too much happening. The, the space is not big enough for me to, to concentrate in. The excuse train is in full swing, everybody. Like stopping, stopping these guys like outright is, is just, it's too tough. It is too tough right now. And once I killed the, uh, the initial two zealots, I thought, I didn't think there were going to be two more. That just made things even worse. So I think what I'll do is I'll try to cycle between going back here and seeing what I can do in that, in that regard. But yeah, th this is going to be rough. Also, I do have the blast arrows. You see that's that's just another thing that I just kept... I kept uh, 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 not paying attention to. So I gotta pay attention to that this time around.
Here, they can have that. Okay, that takes care of her. Both of them are back again. Okay. No! <laughs> uh, let's see here. Um, one of them is exposed, I think. I'm going to have to take it. I just don't have anything else. I'm just going to have to use another flash just to make this easy. Okay, what else can we do here? Finding, finding this room back here was what I needed. <laughs> oh my gosh, that was just insanity. Luck. That was insanity. <laughs> Luck, I say. Uh, but we made it. Made it because we persevered through the challenge. But yeah, it was it was frustrating. Finding, find, like I said, finding the space back here was, I think, um, is definitely what helped us out. So what am I doing now? Am I placing... Place a gold bottle here, okay. And it opens this. That's the elegant chessboard, y'all. 
But yeah, you know, uh, one thing that is uh, that, that that I definitely need to continue to like kind of maintain, you know, when it comes to my play style is uh, realizing that you know we're not going to complete these things, you know, on the first try. That's just you know that's just how things are gonna work. We have to be mindful to the fact that, you know, the, we're, we're going to struggle, you know, we're going to struggle when it comes to when it comes to doing this. And, you know, the best way to find to best way to get through it is just be patient and and find, you know, find strategies to make things work. Just making sure we're not missing anything else. And even if that means, you know, dying like several times to figure it out, but when the when it gets chaotic, yeah, let's just place place that back. When it gets chaotic, that's when things can get a little uh That's when things can get a little um what's the word word I'm thinking of? Uh adrenaline pumping, you know? Uh, an uh, anxiety inducing. What do we need? We need the uh, the gray one. Yeah. But yeah, it's like I I they loaded me up with just enough, just enough ammo just right. to get past that point. <laughs> Let's see here. Okay, so the gold bottle was the second one we were looking for. Hello, stranger. Thank you for appearing just in time, my man. It was getting rough for me out there. Okay, so we got more blue medallions. Okay. The blue medallions have hung around for too long. They are an eyesore and need to go. Someone bring them down. It's bad luck to leave them hanging. So uh, we're going to the courtyard. So we know the dogs are probably going to be out there. We might. We we are most likely going to be going through the hedge maze as well. <laughs> Welcome. What can I interest you in? So there was a locked box back where we were, but I don't know if it. There's some things money can't buy. Yeah, resources, red herbs. I just don't know if. Uh... I don't know if we want to, if we want to waste it on the small keys, you know. But we got four, we got ten, so I'll probably, and we got another challenge coming up to give us an additional seven, so I'll go ahead and get one. <laughs> you can't I might consider the gunpowder, but we'll see. We don't have anything to uh, put this stuff in yet. A deal well struck. <laughs> that cash in your pocket or your life. Easy Definitely choice. need to repair you. Good luck <laughs> to you, stranger. Yeah, like I said, you know, really being uh if you uh, want a fighting chance out there, you best tune up. You really got to be you really got to watch like what you what am I using the most, you know? Probably handgun ammo. So I'll probably go ahead and just increase the power of that. Yeah. There you are. As you wished. Got and again, I think we can probably trade maybe for something stranger. else, but we'll go ahead and wait. <laughs> Thank you. Do check out my wares again soon. We'll see what the game is willing to give us. <laughs> okay, so we're running short, y'all, but this is just how we roll in this game. <laughs> okay, Luis, that's two. Last one should be in a room accessible from the castle wall. You bring them all to the top of the wall, and I'll have your amber. Oh, and here's some more info I've recovered about that old rock. Sending it now. Okay. Let's see. 
Amber research report number one. Our experiments are still ongoing, but I can already see that this test subject has great potential. To summarize our findings so far, even in a state of suspended animation, it holds influence over parasites. It seems to possess the same organ as the dominant species and likely has the same level of control. We still have no method to awaken it. Furthermore, after a deadly accident, we have decided to take extra precautions and seal the amber in a protective case. This is also why I plan to move the amber research lab to the new comms facility. I guess this is where I say adios to Don Quixote. It was Lewis who discovered these things, but Sadler does not trust him. I just hope he keeps his mouth shut. Annabelle Garcia Escudero, head researcher. But yeah, locked treasure, I don't even know if we can even get back in there, can we? Or get back to that, uh, get back to that space? Okay, we know what's gonna be in here. I'm grabbing me some bass. It's a big one. This is a big one, dude. It's a large bass. And they grace us with another. I think I say a herb. And I only saw only saw that one bass, so oh well. Okay, never mind. It's a velvet blue. <laughs> it isn't what I needed, nor what I wanted. Okay, where we're we heading to. That's a red barrel. They keep giving us all these gems, and we don't have any uh, anything sacred to put them in. <laughs> so our next uh, next stop is the hedge maze. Hmm. So we're gonna need uh, another twelve. Are we going to need another five of the of the gunpowder to stand a chance in here? Let's see what we'll be run, running it up against. Oh, wow. Yeah, I don't have enough. I don't have enough right now to really, like, handle him. There we go. Where is he? I thought I saw him, like, in that area there. He must be running around. Yeah, there he is. He's kind of hitting himself to where... Getting to him might be impossible. I don't know. 
Because he's got that helmet on, plus it's hard to see from up here. We got no shotgun ammo, so... Somebody right in front of me, I can't even see him. Okay, now he's up there. Okay, we got some blast arrows. Man, it is impossible to see. Where'd he go? I might have I might have went the wrong way now. <laughs> Yeah, he's back up. Uh, yeah, where is he? Oh, there he is. Come here, you idiot. <laughs> okay, we got it. You can't even see it because it's too dark. Yeah, we're not taking no chances with this guy. We don't, yeah, we need it. There we go. Took care of all y'all. It's all nice and quiet again, thank God. And another flash grenade. We didn't even need to, to use our resources to make one. We found another. Lower yourselves. Blood. <laughs> I'm just kidding. So let's find these medallions now that it's all quiet. Okay, there's another one. Now, where are the others? We're gonna find them soon, Ada. Yeah, there was one there too.
Yeah, I was thinking maybe we would have the dogs uh, through uh, through this section, but um, turns out it was just mutated plaga zealots. Yeah, I don't understand like why it is so dark. I feel like when I was uh, going through this uh, uh, through this section with Leon, it was lighter than this. And I haven't really changed my settings at all, so my settings are pretty much the same as what they've as what they have been. I did turn up the brightness a little bit. Well, technically the gamma. I turned up the gamma a little bit um, on like my second playthrough. Let's see here. For now, I'm just trying to trying to find the uh, the medallions organically. I think we have we have three out of five, but if it does uh, proceed to be any any longer, um, as far as like you know being able to find the last two, I might go ahead and and, and try to look for them. Okay, here's one. Don't initially see the last one yet. But you know, one thing I would come to expect from uh, from this playthrough is uh, is the fact that they are. Here we go, another flash grenade. Thanks, guys. There's a butterfly lab. Okay, we we have some use for our jewels here. Now let's see. Seventeen K. Now, if I find the elegant mask, I'm gonna be honest, we have let's see, one, two, three, four. We have all five colors. If I find the elegant mask before I get a chance to sell this, I'll probably just use it for that. Uh, use the gemstones instead for the for the elegant mass. I need my hundred K. I thought I saw something blue over there, but maybe not. I'm not saying it yet. I'll give myself maybe like another 60 seconds. Okay, never mind. <laughs> Can we like open up this door? I guess not. Here we go. That should do it. All right, guys. We didn't need the map. We found them all organically. Now, when I when I initially did see them on the map before, I wasn't really paying attention to like where they where they were. Let's see here. It doesn't look like there's anything else in the courtyard, so we can go ahead and head out of here. But yeah, I wasn't initially paying attention to their exact locations. I saw them on the map when I pulled the map up, but I didn't really like try to pay attention to exactly where they were. Okay, I just want to make sure I'm not missing anything. Because right now, resources are highly, highly valuable for me. Yeah, see, here we go. Some additional gunpowder as well, huh?
Okay, that looks a little bit better. <laughs> That's the only thing you might be good at in this entire game. The sparkly stuff on the ground was like making me think, oh, item on the ground? Nope. Yes. Anytime I find more ammo and more resources, it's always a better day, everybody. Oh, there we go. Telling you, this is why looking around is highly, uh, highly necessary. Invest investigate every dead end. You never know what may be hiding there. So pretty much what we're what we're trying to do now is uh, just trying to figure out where we're going. Going from here, we gotta find out where that door is. Because it's not the typical way in, uh, uh, up this, uh, up this way. I don't think it is. Maybe it is. Figured there'd be a collectible here. There's not. We were already over there. And it's not that way. Which way do we go? <gasps> let's actually go back. And then let's go up on this ledge. There we go. Okay, we found it. Alright, we're not leaving anything out there just yet. The last ingredient's not far now. That's a sapphire. Okay. Oh boy. I thought we left the castle behind, everybody. But we're diving deeper and deeper in. That sound. Uh oh. That's right. I still have some unfinished business to take care of. No, you do not. <laughs> you you halt it with that. Okay, we got plenty of small resources, we just don't have enough gunpowder. We can make some blast arrows, but we'll keep them where it is for now.
So, what's become of the Amber? Sorry, nothing yet. But my little helper is creating quite the commotion. Everything will work out just fine. As long as you can keep your dog under control. He's a good boy. Predictable. Fine. Keep your mutt. But don't come crying to me if you get bit. Yeah, I always thought that was Krauser at first, but, you know, happens to be Weska. Uh-oh. Leon, changed your mind yet? Yeah. Assuming you haven't, I've got a tip for you. Seems like something big is about to go down in the throne room. Babysitting's tough, huh? Ada? Ada? Ah, damn it! <laughs> Thought I heard somebody else's footsteps. Probably, right? No, Leon took care of most of them. No, somebody's walking down there. I hear someone. How you didn't hear that? I don't know. Why don't we take care of that? Leon, you missed one. Come on, man. Okay, do we want to go down one more? Now, that one locked treasure that is uh, back in that one area, I don't know if I, if I am able to go back uh, to that area. Ah. I just want my gold chicken egg back. How's the game gotta be this cruel to me? Here, let's take this. Increase our health. We didn't need to use it, but you know, of course, uh, I mistook his swing for a uh, for a parry for a parry option. I'm really getting tired of finding the gems, and we can't put anything in them. <laughs> That's what should have happened with the other guy. Instead, we had to waste our health over it. I don't know. You think this is this is uh, this is a viable option to to try to go back here and and see if this works? Okay. It was worth it, everybody. Okay. Like I said, we're, uh, let's see what we have, though. Let's see what we have. Let's see, 29. It's 46 now. Let's put a red barrel in it this time and see what we'll get. Um, Alexandrite. How much was the other one again? <laughs> all right, this is 42.9. Let's uh, remove all these. Remove all these. Forty-two nine. Forty-two nine. Okay, yeah, this is way better. And then this one. Forty 
14. It's 21 with a 3 color bonus. Let's see how much it would be with like two blues and a red. 21. Yeah, so it's a little bit better with three reds. So remove all. Okay. Let's go back to the merchant, sell this stuff, see if there's anything we can do as far as upgrades. You picked up the treasure. You have awakened the gods. More enemies will so be thrown upon you. Good uh, stuff, mate. Oh yeah, I forgot. We well can turn done. this in too. Deserves payment in kind. Well then, what can I do you for? So we got thirteen. We could just do another small key. What's Let's do another that? small key. How have we procured these curiosities? <laughs> you don't want to know. Mate. And gunpowder, I'm just gonna wait on. I'm just gonna wait on the gunpowder. Oh, I knew you choose that one. <laughs> and then velvet blue. Okay. Stranger. Ooh, Ooh guys, I can increase my run speed. Uh, we have enough. Why not try your hand at a new gun, stranger? Might save your life. Knife is okay for now, a I think. A well-tuned weapon can make up for a lack of skill, friend. Hmm. Let's do power. This kind of work is about finesse. Let's do power. Little bit goes a long way. You see. Ammo there capacity. You As you. Well, well, what's that? Ammo or reload? I think it might have been reload. Let's see. I think rate of fire is fine. Molding a weapon to suit your specific needs. <laughs> this kind of work is about finesse, stranger. Okay. It goes a long way. Hope to see you again. Soon, stranger. All right, guys. I'm going to go ahead and conclude here. I wish that I, I had time to keep going. I really wish I do. But, you know, work calls and it, it is what I must uh, do in order to uh, go on, you know. So we are um, in okay shape. You know, we, we have another challenge ahead of us where we'll likely be facing uh, another version of El Gigante if he does appear. We'll, uh, we'll see what happens with that. And, uh, you know, this chapter has been actually pretty long so far because I think I started Chapter 4 in the last one maybe about halfway through. So we're almost done. I think I'm going to probably conclude this chapter like probably right when we get through like the first like major segment in the uh in the next video so hope that you guys enjoyed this one like i said it was very tough with the knights and the uh and the and the uh, bow wielding uh crossbow wielding zealots in that room but when we got that second area open things uh were a little bit better and it's just about strategy, trial and error, you know, like the first time through, you know, you're not expecting like the outside forces to come in and and throw down on you. You know, I thought it was just the knights I was going to have to deal with. And uh, when it came down to the zealots, then it's like you got to figure out what. OK, what, now what kind of a strategy do I need to uh, curve myself into to figure out how to get past like the next phase of this you know so you know we went through it at least like what two to three times i think maybe on the third time i finally passed it but you know sometimes it's through luck sometimes it's just you know through uh you know creating the right opportunities to take down the enemies and get past through the difficult phases of what the game is challenging you with so if you guys are enjoying this playthrough so far make sure to stay connected because when i get off work tonight i'm absolutely absolutely going to be diving back into this hopefully be finishing up this chapter or whatnot if you guys also enjoyed how i have been making it through piece by piece um 
with uh, very little to go on and um, just trying to keep myself together and realize that, you know, this game is is very fun. It's very challenging. And, you know, those are the things that, you know, we need to remember when it comes to playing this. Beating these things on the first try is not always, you know, going to be viable. And sometimes it's just better to really figure out the strategies, do it a few times and, you know, see how you fare. If you guys enjoy all of that, make sure to throw a like on it. I would appreciate it. And uh, give me a comment if you are enjoying Ada's uh, separate ways story so far. If you're playing or watching, let me know what you're thinking about it all and I will catch you when the next one's ready to go.